everyone, welcome to Vampire Survivors. I've been playing a shit ton of this game lately, and it is really, really frickin' fun. <laughs> I have unlocked a whole ton of new characters since I last played on stream. It has been really quite fun. <laughs> uh, I've also gotten a lot of gold, so I have a lot of the upgrades now. Which picks up. Okay. Good. I have basically everything now. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna. Now, okay, so we're gonna do Antonio first. Antonio is the basic character that you start with. He has a whip. And otherwise, just he uses a whip. <laughs> he's very quite. He's quite simple. Wow, I'm so good at explaining this. Okay, let's try it again. Antonio has a whip. It strikes out both sides. It's cre It's uh, increased. The number of like strikes is increased by how many projectiles you have. So I start with a bonus projectile uh, from my passive tree, and because of that, he has an extra strike. Uh, it evolves into the bloody tear, and I'll show you the evolution in a little bit. That'll be the first thing I go for. I just actually need a up that tells me what the evolutions are. I think it's the... I don't remember. Hollow Heart, okay. The uh, Laurel's gonna go well with it. That gives you a damage reduction. Nice. Yeah. Okay, Laurel. What do I want with? Oh, with Cross. Now that I've played this game a little bit more, now I kind of understand. How it works. So I have a I have a better idea what's going on. Okay, so for evolutions. Oh, hi Ron. So for evolutions. Oh, I'm just I'm just playing Antonio and introducing how he functions. The empty tome is to upgrade the magic wand, the candle labradors to upgrade the axes, and the spellbinders to upgrade the Bible. Yeah, okay. I think the... I'm going to say that the uh, King Bible is going to be the best option here, so I'm going to go with Spellbinder. I'd love to hear what you think of the audio balance. I have just changed, like, all my settings, so things are going to be a little bit different than... First order of business is to get myself a hollow heart, so that I can level up. Yeah. Yep. Tractor. Santa water. Not really using stuff right now. That focus on the laurel. Really need to have this in a separate window. I can actually. I can check chat and I can look at this. You know, all the all the important things. Awesome. Good to hear that it's. I've split the uh, I've split the audio between the I used to record my desktop audio I don't anymore now I'm specifically recording Vampire Survivors and the music separately so I'm going to have another audio channel to work with I think oh god maybe I'm not going to have another audio channel to work with this actually might be kind of a mess well whatever. If 
things go to shit, they go to shit. I'll figure that out later. Okay, King Bible. So the main thing we're looking for is the Hollow Heart to upgrade the whip, because that's the first evolution I'm going to be going for, showing off his evolution, since whip is his specialty. God, these things are really weird. They're like Easter Island heads if you made an Easter Island head out of a tree. The treants, yes. Think. Okay. Rollo is for garlic. I'm gonna actually get the Claw Clan set. I don't have what it takes to upgrade that yet, but that's okay. Or to evolve it yet, but it's very useful. It's actually the only thing that can stop the Grim Reaper, the uh, final boss, at the end of every level. Because it can, because the Grim Reaper can still be frozen. Nothing else really works on him, and I don't know if he actually takes damage. Okay, I know he takes damage, but I don't know if he's killable. God, I love this game. I've been playing it so much. <laughs> okay, whip. Actually, I haven't checked yet. So, we now have a mini-map. Uh, I'm gonna start heading east and see if I can find out whatever that question mark is. Map. Sort of special something waiting for me. Leave too much... Lots of candelabras. Nice. Time stop is good. That will make it much easier to get past all this crap. Oh! There's a boss here. Never mind, that's I'm gonna do for I might try to go for the storm ring as my last weapon. Because it gives bonus projectiles. Ooh! Awesome! The whip level. Okay, I don't know. I'll check the levels later. Crown <laughs> check orb. I need to... to actually start to remember what these are. Crown is for the pentagram. I'm not going to think. I have actually a really weird setup. You know what? I'm gonna go for the pentagram, actually. I need some full area clear. And I'll show off these these things when I actually get to them. I'm just gonna keep heading, hoping to find whatever the question mark item is. I don't think I have what it takes to level up the Yeah, I don't have it unlocked yet. I have the actual, like, evolution list right beside me now. I was, like, trying to unlock them, like, on my own for the longest time, and I still kind of prefer to do that, but after a while I kind of got stuck with not being able to unlock something, like I ran out of options, and this just basically tells me that I don't have the items yet. That's fine. I'll get more items. Also need to make sure I'm hitting more candelabras. I am. Because I can get some... I can get the uh, tracked all XP power-up. I've left a lot of XP behind, so that'll be really nice. Okay, hey, whip is level six. Oh, 
Not the right power-up. Oh, stone mask. Nice. Um, if I hit discard, does it leave it here, or does it just destroy it? Oh, it destroys it! Oh. Well, I wouldn't have destroyed it then if I knew I had knew that was the options. Okay, spinach is used to level up the fire wand. I don't have that. Floral. Floral just gives you invulnerability. Oh wait, I left the boss behind. I love the flamethrower power up. I fuck something up in my I will have to fix that later. It's it's okay. I'll still be able to use this, but I'm not going to be able to easily split the audio like I'd like to in editing. Some easy way to do that, but oh, not looking good for that. Sorry about this. I'm trying to make this make sense. Editing. And I'm kind of screwing something up. Game capture. Which... Right? I think that's right. I think I finally got that right, actually. If I don't, it'll still work out, but... Okay. That's right now. Thank you, thank you all for waiting. It's I'm still trying to figure out the whole streaming thing. Process. Lightning ring. Yes! I'm still going to go to the right to get the power-ups, but I want to get all this juke XP. Oh, so much XP. Give me it all. Put it all in me. Anyway. This, this game is like... It's so satisfying. It looks so simple. But it's really satisfying. Like, they actually... They managed to make something that's like... A lot better than I than like I feel like it should be just based on its graphics alone, but like it's it's really good. Like the graphics aren't even bad, like they're just old school. And that's not bad. I don't know, it just it's actually quite impressive as far as games go. And it's very enjoyable to play. Very happy that uh, the YouTuber I was watching uh the other day, started to play this game because I never would have found it if it wasn't for that. Ooh, coffin! Oh my god! What is this? What have I found? They look like... 
They kind of look like the Wizard of Oz monkeys if they were skeletons. Mine monkey. Oh, this might be... This might be a new character, actually. Let me think of it. Oh, do I have to kill everything? I might need to kill everything around me. If I have to kill all these things, it might take a moment. They're very bulky. Man. Eh. I mean, they are kind of body blocking the rest of the shit, but they're very, very bulky. Okay. I'd really like to kill a few of these. That'd be nice. Not coming after me, they're just floating back and forth. Very mindlessly. That is very strange. I really like whatever's in there. Okay, thanks. You just, like, die for me? That'd be nice. Bit busy with all the other crap. Okay, got another one. No, there's still more. Is Stacy the last one? No, he is not the last one. Not by a long shot. Come on. Okay, that one's down. There's a few more left. Ah! And this boss is really being a pain in the boss. much small shit getting in my way. No. Oh, for anyone who's, like, super confused, I am intentionally avoiding the treasure chest. That's not an accident. Because if I can... Because the treasure chests have the ability to give you the weapon evolutions. And the only way I can evolve... My whip is if I get the hollow heart first. I'm hoping that the next level up will give me the hollow heart, then I can take the treasure chest immediately, level it up, and then I will be just, like, super powerful by comparison. That's how I am now. Eh. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Damn it! I really... Really need the hollow heart, it's kind of important. Come on. Okay, the duplicator is good, because that, that is what I need to upgrade the lightning ring and to, uh, to evolve it, and it'll also give me another projectile for my wand. Or my wand, my whip. And my whip has, like, super whippy. Super whippiness. Whippiness. No! Damn it! Give me the hollow heart! I need it! You know what? There's another boss now. I'm just gonna take. I'm gonna take the treasure chest. I can get another treasure chest from the boss. Lightning ring. Lightning ring. Well, I completely forgot that I was actually trying to kill this guy over here. The problem is that he's in, like, a really bad spot. Oh, there we go. There we go! What the fuck? Thank you, Antonio Bellapisa, but the vampire's in another coffin. Giovanna Grana joins the survivors. Okay, so that is another character I've unlocked. That's nice. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, please. Please. I need... I need one particular upgrade, that's it! 
I have empty slots for it. I just... I just need to get it. It just needs to pop up. Yeah. XP. Okay, that's fucking it. Vanish. Vanishing the empty dome. I'm not gonna take it. Vanish just means that it will not show it will not show up again as an option. So I don't have to worry about it like logging up my possible upgrades list because I'm never gonna take it. Hollow Heart, okay. This is what the whip does. It becomes the bloody tear. And deal critical damage and absorbs HP. Please, there we are. Now I have some li now I have like some actually really strong life steal. So this will make my life a whole lot easier now. That. Not close to any other upgrades, I don't know. Minor upgrade! Additional projectile! Okay. Cross! Upgrade the perk slider. Because you just need to have the perk, you don't need to have the perk upgraded to evolve the- to, like, fuse it with a weapon. Nice. I can go and grab all the XP while these things can't touch me. Bible. And then you can do to touch me right now. Me. I will steal your HP. Die, bat, die. Super bat, you have no power here. Not against the bloody tear. Ooh! Oh! Oh my gosh! Quintuple chest! That's awesome. That's almost a thousand gold. Level 4 King Bible. And level 5 King Bible. 5 Cross. Level 2 Crown. Level 3 Clock Lancet. So the Clock Lancet's gonna go off more, which is really nice. It's really useful. Armor is for evolving Rune Tracer. I'm not using the Rune Tracer. When you go off screen from an area where, like, um, things like Candelabras are likely to spawn. They, they, I don't know what, like, how long it takes, but they do respawn. So you can kind of, like, walk back and forth between two areas where Candelabras spawn. And then you can just, like, keep breaking them for power-ups. Level 6. Okay, so I need... Uh, Two more lightning rings or two more king bibles, and I can evolve. I can fuse them. Just need a couple more upgrades. Okay, cross. That works. Okay, lightning ring. Okay. Okay. Damn it. <laughs> Racers are to evolve the knife. 
I don't care. I'll get... I'll get the clover, because I do not want to turn down getting lucky. Ooh, red crystal over there. And yes, I'm going to make that joke, like, every time I play this game. Ooh, flamethrower! Wow, there's so much stuff over here! Ah! Awesome! There's so much XP that the pickup thing could not pick it all up. The attract orb. Make my way back over here. Yep, cross, okay. Because, oh, oh, there's a red thing, red crystal. Those are like the best. Blue are, blue are the basic XP, green are like the slightly upgraded XP, and red are like kill the boss XP. Oh my gosh, I'm never gonna go if I don't go now. A binder. And now I'm gonna fuse something. Okay, the cross has been fused. Cross becomes the Heaven Sword. Still critical damage. It is the sword thing there. It's actually really cool. It's a bit strange, but it's cool. Can I upgrade it? No, I can't upgrade it. Okay. Only, as far as I know, only one. Uh, there's only one, uh, up, like evolved weapon that can be leveled up, and I only know of one evolved weapon that can be. Um. I only know of one evolved weapon that can be re evolved again. Thunder loop. Okay, the thunder loop is my favorite, like one of my favorites, if not my favorite, of all of the weapon evolutions. It takes a second to recharge, and then chain lightning. It's like mass chain lightning. I love it. Oh man. Lots of things. So much XP. So much XP. Can't pick up all the XP. I know, there's just so much. It's overwhelming at times. Okay, there's still something I'm missing to upgrade stuff. The King Bible. I have the one upgrade for the King Bible. Oh, I don't know what the upgrade for the Clock Lens set is. I Okay, I don't have access to that upgrade. Uh, the Laurel. Where's the Laurel? I don't have access to that upgrade. And the King Bible, I have the stuff ready to upgrade as soon as I get another chest. Okay, so I can just pick a random uh, perk then. So I'm going to pick the Attract Orb because it makes you pick up XP from farther away. And that's really, really good because... Holy shit, your XP pickup range is absolutely awful in this game at the start, even if you buy all of the perks. And don't get me wrong, buy all the perks, it's worth it, but it's still rough. Yeah, green crystals. Ooh, flamethrower! Yes, please. Only wish there was a boss here. Oh, and that was... That was something. That must have been a cross. Pick the Hollow Heart. Definitely want to keep upgrading the Hollow Heart, because it gives you more maximum HP. 
and it's very easy to recover HP when you have something that steals life, like the Bloody Tear does. Yeah, I would love a Super Bat right now. But first... This is the upgrade to the King Bible. The Unholy Vespers. Okay, King Bible ends, and Unholy Vespers. It's basically the King Bible, except for the projectiles never go away. Wait. Because, like, the King Bible turns off every once in a while. That's, like, one of its worst aspects. Also, the Unholy Vespers and the King Bible... Or especially the Unholy Vespers are really good at destroying projectiles. Just because, like, a projectile can't get through that ring without being hit, and that ring will just instantly destroy any projectiles. We should be seeing a boss soon. Thanks. I'm not used to having all my weapons fused by this point. <laughs> not even 20 minutes in yet. Getting better at the game. Also getting more perks. I definitely noticed that, like, it really... Oh, there's the boss. It really helps to pick one particular weapon you want to evolve first, and, like, evolve one weapon intentionally at a time. It just... It works so much better when you give it that chance. There we go. Ooh. Is this a quintuple again? Oh, yeah. Oh, triple hollow heart. That gives me another 60% max health and another 40% pickup range. Total. That's awesome. Yeah, two, two in one round. I'm surprised. Ooh, a track orb. Awesome. Okay, so yeah, there. I can go and get the uh, the empty tome now. Because now that I have all my perks set, uh, any perks that I pick up on the ground in the level will just count as extras, basically, and go on top of the maximum number of perks you can have. This is much simpler when you have a whole shit ton of leveled up weapons. Just walk through things. My only issue is that I'm running out of ways to get more powerful. Oh, sure, I'll use this. Why not? More gold coins, yay! I don't care. I was too intent on farming them at the start, and then I just got so many that it doesn't really matter anymore. Ooh. Hello. Hello, friend. No, nope, you can't get near me, bloody ghosts. Okay, between the King Bible, the Bloody Tear, and the Clock Lancet, like, nothing can touch me. Also, that treasure chest just broke and, like, gave me gold, because that's my only option from the treasure chest now. Until I get something, a chance to... Until I get that other perk that's on the ground. So, the match or round is going to end at 30 minutes. I've got about another 9 minutes to survive, assuming that I do survive that long. And then... I will see... Well, then I'll complete it with this character. 
which is good because you uh, there's achievements for completing all the levels with each character. So I intend to continue working on that for a while. <laughs> Ooh, Jackdorf, nice. Oh no. Oh no, I left a lot of XP behind. Uh-oh. 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 So much XP! It's all chasing me, too. Yep! <laughs> There's the glut of it. Oh, that actually wasn't as much as I expected, okay. Also, I, re just, I just realized during this round that if I hit spacebar, it automatically accepts the level up with whatever you're you highlighted, which in this case is just the first option, by default, which is just get more money. The other option is get food, and that doesn't really help me right now, because I'm full health, and I have at least one type of lifesteal. Super bat! There you go, Ron. Here's your super bat. Order 38 from that. Nice. That must have been a triple. Super bad. Super bad. Cross. At 25 minutes, we will see a boss. The, uh, bitch of the stage. Or, the boss of the stage, which is the witch, I meant. Okay. Man, this thing is really far away. They make the stuff that's on the stage is really... Really just quite far away from you. Would you like to watch me walk left? I hope so! Because <laughs> I'm walking left! That is... that is the extent of what I'm doing, apparently. Okay, almost there. I don't really need the candelabras, but I just... I get them out of habit now. Oh. Oh. Okay, this, these things actually are, like, kind of tanky. I'll just have to walk slightly slower. They're not threatening me, I just I can't walk too fast. I just can't walk too fast. Okay, almost at the upgrade. Oh. Always picks the rest of the run. Oh, that probably makes it much easier. Uh, just in case, I'm going to pick the floor chicken, because I don't care about the gold. Because at some point, I'm probably going to need the health whenever I level up. Oh, there it is. There's the upgrade. Reduce weapon cooldown. That helps most things. And now I walk all the way back. No, I'm kidding. I'm not gonna walk all the way back. <laughs> I don't. I don't hate y'all or me that much. There is the stage boss. Walk right. Okay, hey, level up. Oh, 
Oh, I shouldn't have picked the always yet because I still I can't get the level ups for the uh, for the other thing anymore. For the uh, empty tome. Oh no, that was a mistake probably. Actually, it doesn't matter because it just auto levels me up now, so I don't have to worry. But it's taking forever. Now we take our hands off the key. Damn it, I have to touch the keyboard. <laughs> or do I? Yes, I do. I don't want to get eaten by Medusa. <laughs> like hiding someplace like here actually makes me more secure because things can't come in from north. So many Medusas. Uh oh. What was that? Oh, they're being pushed by lesser mobs. That's why. Uh... This is getting a bit much. Uh, uh, Medusa, go away. No, leave me alone. No, turn to sender. Yeah, I'm gonna go hide back over here again. I don't have to worry about things north of me anymore. Okay. There. I think that's the ultimate spot. Is boss gonna spawn at the minute mark? Yes, okay, so a boss spawns at each minute mark then. Here, Medusa. Yeah, it is kinda crazy. And this, like, I don't even have, like, the craziest weapons either, like, there are definitely crazier weapons than this that, like, look ridiculous. So many level ups. Clock Land set is doing so much work. Everything that's turned blue is because the Clock Land set is protecting me. All of that stuff's frozen. Okay, another boss somewhere. Oh. Oh no. Oh no, this is the time when all the bosses come. I forgot. Okay, so everything is a boss now. Uh, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. Uh. Just survive 30 more seconds. Uh. No. Alone. Branding order. Ah. My restraining order is specifically against treants! And whatever the fuck the green things are! No. 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 Every time I level up, I'm getting... I'm getting more health. Oh! And... done. And that is the Grim Reaper that I don't know if you can kill or not. Do it right here, because that means everything will hit him. I really do not think you can kill him. Or, I don't know if you can kill him. The fact that he flashes, though, 
And the fact that he's vulnerable to status effects does suggest that maybe you can kill him. So... I'm just gonna keep dealing damage to him until he kills me. So. Ah, damn it. Stage complete. Oh, what? Fuck it. I don't care about the extra hundred. Awkward plan set. Do something. I don't like. I don't know if I can kill him or not. So I'm just gonna keep. Okay, that's really rude. Don't... I can't kill... Okay. If I can kill one, I certainly can't do it while another one is on me. <laughs> uh, well, I unlocked Giovanna. That's exciting. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, that... Uh... That was Antonio. He's pretty fun to play, even though he's the basic character. Like, all the characters are really good. Okay, let's power ups in. Recovery. Read. I can't finish that. The last one will be Curse, which increases the enemy speed, health, quantity, and frequency. Which, I guess, just makes the game harder. Oh, oh shoot. Fun power-ups. All over again. Okay. Lock Giovanna this time. Then finish the power ups. Cool. Okay, so we're gonna try Giovanna this time now. I've never played with her before. I don't even know what that ability is that a cat? Okay. Gains 1% projectile speed every level. Okay. Interesting. I... Since I have no idea what her ability is... Uh, favorite character. Probably the stinky old man. Oh, since uh, garlic is really fun. Um, yeah, def I definitely do really like Poe. Anyone else who I like... One other one that I really like is uh, Gennaro, because uh, he has a permanent plus one to all projectiles, which is pretty frickin' great. And he starts with the knife. He was, like, the one I originally evolved the knife with, and that was fun. Okay, I'm going to go to the stage, I guess. I don't know. I'm going to hurry mode, which basically means that the clock moves twice as fast, and you get bonus XP. So... We'll finish this in 15 minutes, rather than 30. What? Oh. Wait, I summon cats? I summon cats? I'm so happy. Oh, so those will count as projectiles then. Okay. Okay, those are project. Oh man, how am I gonna do this? Um, I guess Rune Tracer. Trying to think like what, what other weapons are going to work well with it. Uh, Fire Wand, that also does projectiles. A clover. What does clover do? Clover's for the cross. I want the cross again. Not really. Oh, I can reroll. Uh, tracked orb is 
Santa water, wings are full. Something I don't have. Thank you, kitties. Good old Nyaz. Be off to victory. Yadiamari, that's what it's named. Okay. Let's see. Looking at my list here. This is what evolves with the stone axe. Or the st stone axe. The stone math. Math? Oh my god. This is what evolves with the stone mask. I've been wondering what evolves with the stone mask for a while now. Okay, lightning ring won't evolve for... Won't, lightning ring won't be helped by the increased uh, projectile oh, that the character has, so I'm not going to bother with that. So, what's actually... So, they're not cat bombs. What's actually happening is the... The cats are, like, running by, scratching things, and leaving. That's what they're doing. They're not exploding. Okay, armor to evolve the Rune Tracer. So as soon as the Rune Tracer is... is at level 8, I can evolve it. Tractor Orb... Oh yeah, that was for the Santa Water. A Skullomaniac... Not using that. Uh, I'll use the axes. I don't really have any direct way of being like, hey, we need... Okay, I just got the stone mask. I don't have any direct way of being like, hey, I want you to kill the things that are near me. Which is kind of unfortunate, but... I'll, I'll be okay, probably. <laughs> I guess I'll take Pichone. I guess, okay, so I guess my last two weapons are going to be Pichone and uh, Ebony Wings, which we'll fused together. Eh! Getting really hard to avoid things! This is one of the characters with a slow start, is what I'm getting from this. Yay! Got Yamari. Okay, level four. Five. I also have to remember not to avoid the cats, because they're not dangerous to me. Very easy to forget that they're not dangerous. To me. Okay. The minecart. Something hit the minecart, please. Something hit the minecart. It'll kill a bunch of shit. If something hits the bike cart, it'll kill everything on the tracks! Okay, I'm not gonna bother then. Ebony wings? Okay. Oh! What was that? I think if the cats come in contact with each other, something special happens. Now they hit the mine cart. That's interesting. No, I don't want duplicator. Actually, did I pick anything I don't- I can't level up? Or evolve. I everything I have would benefit from the duplicator. I could once I evolve, once I fuse the uh, ebony wings and the pichone together, I will have an empty weapon slot. So I could take duplicator now and then take storm ring as the very last thing. That because like the duplicator will help me. All everything I have is projectiles. The uh, storm ring doesn't benefit from projectile speed, as far as I know, but that's okay. All I hear is meows. I love it. I 
think the cats, like, ran into each other and, like, they created a damaging field. Oh. Uh, okay, I'm about to level up a whole bunch. Okay, that was nice. Ah, uh, Rune Tracer. Okay, so I just got level 8 to uh, Gadiamare. So this is going to be the ev the evolution or the fusion of the cats. What is that? Vicious hunger might turn anything into gold. Okay. What, is, what the fuck does that mean? Oh, I really hope it helps me soon, though. Whatever it is. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, you just get a bunch of eyeballs. That's kind of cool. Oh, I see why projectile speed is with this particular character. Because the faster those move, the more damage they're going to deal over time. Because they need to... Like, the more things they can hit, like, per second, basically. Eh. Having a hard time avoiding things. Chicken! No. Okay, two cater. Oh, there's a Minotaur horde coming. Ooh! Cry right chest! So the armor is to level up the rune tracer. Rune tracer. What? At level four now. That's good. Gonna. Gonna kind of try to hide. Well, all the eyeballs do their work. And y'all just like murder this boss or something? That would be really great. Ooh. I get this getting a bit dicey. Pichonai. I don't know why they don't just call it Ivory Wings, considering the black one's called Ebony Wing. I feel like that makes more sense, but that's just. Okay, I could really... Oh god, I just summoned something by stepping on that. The, like, sewer grates have a tendency to summon things when you step on them. Oh, I summoned a bunch of jellyfish, that's what happened. I could really use more health. Really badly. That'd be really nice. Something killed the boss. Thank you. I don't have much protection with this character, that's for sure. Everything I have kind of, like, fucks off and does its own thing. Like, the knives, you can control the direction to protect yourself. The garlic protects everything around you. Um, the King Bible pushes everything back. It protects everything around you. Oh no. Oh, this is not looking good. Oh no, this is not good. Okay. Evolution for the Fire Wand. Good. That perk. Eh. Oh. Eyes. Eyeballs. 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 Eyeballs! Help me! Ah! This is very stressful. No. God, maybe I... Should have picked a pentagram in retrospect. I mean, hindsight is 2020. Oh god. Oh, I'm so screwed. Oh no. 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 Ah! Eyeballs, please do something for me. You are not helping. Oh, cool. I just got a 
Again. Oh, I am so fucked. I am so very fucked. I am in a corner. Babby's been put in the corner. I probably should stop making that reference, because I don't actually know what it's from. Okay, axe. And tracer. The good thing is, at least I'm getting a shit ton of XP from this, but... It doesn't matter if I die. Fire wand. Rune Tracer. One more level and I can get the Rune Tracer leveled up. Like, I can get it evolved. Okay. Rune Tracer's ready to evolve. I need a chest. Fire wand. Oh, there's a chest. There's a chest. There's a chest in the south of me. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Rune Trice has evolved into no future. This one is actually, like, surprisingly si no future is surprisingly similar to the, um, uh, ah, to the, uh, cat, cat balls. Cat balls, oh my god. Cat eyeball things. I think cat balls sounds awesome. Ah, uh, I almost said awesome. Awful. That's the word I'm looking for. It sounds awful. Kill a maniac. Not for what I need. Armor will help me the most. What do I st what do I not have? I have the spinach for the fire wand. I have the ca the candle labrador for the axe. I have the two doves defeat. The other two are few. And if I get okay, so I'm I'm just I just have a free perk right now. That means. So, in that case, I'm going to take the Attract Orb, because I can level up a lot easier if I can reach the XP! It's a good thing I have a revive. Eh. Eh. No. Axe. Please. Please. Save me. I don't know what I'm talking to, but something saved me. Oh no. 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 No. No no no. No 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 no. No. No no no. No no no. No no no. 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 Oh god no. Not another boss. I don't- I couldn't do it with the first one. Ah! I'm taking too much damage! Help. Something help me. No! No! I don't want to die! No! Ah! No! This isn't good! Oh my god! Okay, this is gonna evolve the axe. The axe is an AoE weapon. This might save me or it might not. I had, like, I'm one hit from death. The problem is that it recharges. Oh. This. That's not the axe. Oh, that's Hellfire. That's the. Wand Evolution? Ah! I need a weapon that can protect me.
from myself. No, not from myself. From, like, things around me. Okay. Ugh. <sighs> I'm gonna go on like a three minute intermission and or five minute intermission and then we're gonna come back and play this with a new strategy.
Okay, I'm back. What is this? What is playing? I don't know if I like it. I kind of like dubstep. But I know what everyone does. Which is why I'm skipping. Okay. Let's. See what we're doing next. Oh, yeah. We're trying Giovanna again. Let's try. Okay. Let's try Giovanna again. I want to go on to the. Actually, I'm just going to go to the second stage because it's easier. No, I'm going to go. I'm going to go back to the third stage. Oh, I also was on Hurry, which might have been my downfall. I'm gonna take off Hurry, just cause... Yeah. Okay, I shall cat now. Okay, this time I'm going to pick Lightning Ring immediately, because I'm intend to get the Duplicator. Since the duplicator evolves it, and it also gives me extra projectiles, which I'm going to need with um, Pussy Eyes. I don't care what it's called. Vicious Hunger. Probably better than Pussy Eyes. I'm going to swap. I want to go Knife this time as well. You know what? I'm going to do, I'm going to skip. I want. Uh, I was trying to think of skipping the ebony wings and uh, Pichone. because I'm thinking. So I have Gadiamari, I have Storm Ring, I have Rune Tracer. Then my options are. Either Ebony Wings and Pichone, or that's five other option, and then Knife, I guess. Then if I pick Rune Tracer here, that's like the last option, like the variable. I'm gonna reroll it. I could take Pentagram. It doesn't synergize with this character, but like it might save my ass. Considering I seem to have trouble clearing, I take Pentagram. Let's see if something can hit these. There we go. Oh, also, this map has a ton of shit on it that I can pick up. I'm gonna go for towards the wings. Down south. Southwest, I guess. She looks so cute when she's flying on her broomstick. No. No. Don't like any of that. Okay, this is why I want knife so I can like directly attack things. Kind of challenging. Okay, go up and around. Grab the few XP there. Down. Okay. 
trying to avoid taking too much damage. Really would like it if something would hit the minecart, though. Because the minecart definitely can kill a bunch of shit. Crown. Upgrade the pentagram. And I really would like to upgrade the pentagram. I love there's like a bunch of different colors of kitties that you can get. Like randomly spawn. Okay. Something hit the minecart. Something. Cat? No. That cat did not feel like it. I love the sounds they make. Meow. 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 Okay, duplicated. There we are. Let me hit the fucking minecart! Okay, I'm gonna give up on that plan because it's not working. Okay, directly south of the wing. Let me hit the. Okay, or not. Maybe I just need to be focusing on picking up XP so I can actually have weapons that are useful, besides just... I'm sorry, I love cats, but cats aren't what I would describe as useful. They're just wonderful every other way. Eh. Oh, I hate that pentagram destroys, like, your XP and stuff. That is a good reason to upgrade it, so I will stop doing that. I don't want to step on the circle thingies, because those can spawn things, potentially. Some of them are trapped. There's a stone mask, I just need to level up the Gadiamare now. I can evolve it. Okay, something give me a knife, please. Ah. Ah. Okay. Okay. Ah. I hate that like some of these the stuff here you can't walk through, but the the uh, the enemies can walk through all of it. That's kind of bullshit, to be honest. One thing I really do not like about this level. But also, it's nice to not just play the first and second level constantly. I should really try the fourth level, I've still yet to do that. Okay. Pentagram without being able to upgrade it is pretty not amazing. Like, it gets really good once you have upgrades to it. Cats are doing their thing. Eh. Okay. I don't really want to take Song of Mana, but it's like the only... Th Hold on, reroll. Okay, I think I need to take Magic Wand. Just to get something. I need something that will attack stuff. Because it just attacks the closest thing to you, so I can actually control what it's attacking. Boss. Not. Try. I keep trying to avoid the cats because I'm like, oh no, there's an enemy. No, it's just a good old kitty. Go heckin' kitty. Go get her. Okay, got Amari. That is still a cat. Still not dangerous to me. Oh no. no I don't. I don't like that. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this. Uh... Nope. Give me wings. Okay, now something. Yeah, thank you. Okay. So I can actually kind of break stuff now that I 
have a more controllable weapon. Oh! Gonna stand in here now. While everything walks towards it. Thank you! The knife, finally! Fortunately, it needs to be upgraded for it to actually be decent. But... The knife does upgrade really well. So, there is that. Ow, these things are tanky! Need to aim for the other less tanky one, so I can get the XP off of them dead, rather than trying to kill the tankier one. Not as much return. Oh! But I left a ton of XP behind. No. Like, whatever the fuck that's going on with. Racers. Eh. Hey. Okay. Come this way. Yep. Okay. That trap wasn't as effective as I hoped it would be, but it still did well. Also, if you go off stream, uh, if you go off screen with the minecarts, they will come back as well. I don't know how long you need to be off screen for for them to like come back, but you come back. Okay, got him, Mari. Keep working on it. Oh, good. Okay, now I can focus on picking up the crystals. Push everything away, that's... Whoa, what is that? Uh... Wait, I can't hit it? Okay, I guess I should be focusing on something else if I can't hit it. Okay, everything, walk over here. Uh... I don't know if I can hurt that Reaper thing. Doesn't look like I can. It doesn't look like he's taking any damage. I don't like that. Ugh. Wait, did the pentagram just banish him? No! Ow, that hurt. Had to run into a, another creature just to avoid those, because those would have killed me if I let them run me over. way. Come this way! Come this way! No! No! Yes! Okay, I lost a lot of health trying to do that, but it did kill the boss. Cool, more movement speed. One of the best defensive items in the game. Um, well, I mean, more projectiles is always good. It benefits all of my stuff. Fortunately, these minotaurs are, like, stupid strong. Because I can't really do anything to fight them yet! Hiding in the pile here. Uh, okay, armor's the rune tracer. I'm not taking it. Uh, I don't like this. This has gotten a lot worse! 
Okay, I need... Okay, good. I want to get the chest. Get the chest! Oh... Okay, because some good upgrade. I don't know why I'm, I'm struggling so much more with this character than the other ones. I don't know why. Yes! Minecart. Thank you. Being great. Oh. From all the stories, I can't let things, like, pile up. I have to keep moving, or I'm in, like, serious fucking trouble. Wow, it's so hard to kill any of the Minotaurs. I think I'm just, like, really underpowered right now. I'd really love to upgrade the knives, because as soon as I upgrade the knives, like, I know I can hold down. The knife upgrade... The Thousand Edge, the knife upgrade is really good. Pretty confident on my ability to keep myself safe. The upgrade, the evol evolution. Thank you, Pentagram. Uh oh. Ugh. Okay. At least there's lots of XP here. Ah! Fuck. Fuck. Nope. I'm not staying to find out whatever the hell that I just activated accidentally. No Reaper, no Reaper, no Reaper. Uh, oh. Oh, oh, fuck. Wow, that was significantly harder. Okay. I need to ideally not die this time. Ideally. Okay. Well, fuck. Yeah, I don't want to buy Curse, considering how much I'm having. Let's try someone else. I'm going to go back to my roots. With Amelda. I don't know if the character's rough, or I'm just playing them badly, or what, but... Yeah. I'm, gonna go... I'm really just going to go back to my roots. Magic Missile 1. First level on Hurry. So, double speed. There's Imelda. She starts with the... Starts with the... Magic Missiles. And she has some bonuses to... Uh, projectile damage, I believe. Already forgotten what her bonuses are. Um, something to projectiles, I can't remember. <laughs> Okay, well, I'll pick Gadimari on this, and maybe it'll work a bit better. A different character. Okay. Slowly walk away from the super bat. There we go. Okay. Cross up. The enemies on this level are a lot less rough than the enemies in the third level. That's part of the problem. 
Um, no, 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 no. No. Third bat horde. Bat horde. There we are. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, hurry definitely makes this a lot harder. Pick Kniff. The enemies on the first level are just so much easier than the enemies on the third level. Okay, not super bad. Vintage to evolve. Yeah, Fire Wand. Also, because it gives damage and generic damage. Great. to get some power-ups. I always hate it when you break a light source and it's a coin. Like, that's a single coin is nothing to me. Okay. Try to focus down the boss. Okay, cross. Reroll. I want... Yeah, I want to be able to level up weapons right now. Because the sooner I can evolve my weapons, the better I will do. Because, like, a single evolved weapon does a lot to you. Unless it's the Gadiamari. <laughs> and then it does not. Now, the Gadiamari is, is a good weapon. It's just... It's really hard to focus on the Gadiamari to start with. Because it there's, like... It doesn't protect you from anything, like, you need something to protect you. Like, a zone, like this, for example, that you can stand in, and, like, it'll keep you safe. Or, like, I mean, just like the King Bible makes things so much safer for you. You always have something, like, surrounding you to, like, destroy projectiles and stuff. Nope. Ooh, thank you. I'll take the Kniff. Uh, I let myself get into kind of a rough situation there. Okay. Take the Kniff again. I get hit by things and like I hear my like the da the damage sound I'm like I have no idea what could possibly have just hit me partially because holy shit everything happens at once in this game Gniff. how am I doing on this Level six. Okay, so I need the bracers, and I need two more levels. So tempted to pick the garlic, just because, like, it protects me. I'm gonna pick the garlic. I, it's not... This is not the optimal choice, like, for this build, but... Damn it if it isn't, like, really reliable at protecting you. Because, like, a lot of these enemies, not the not the big bats, but, like, a lot of these enemies I can just walk into. Like, like all the small bats, for example. And they just die. 
great. That's... Aw. They pushed some of the plants out of out of their spots, so like there's now a hole in the garden. Cracked orb, I always forget what this one does. It's for the sand water, okay. I don't need you. Ow. Hey bats, 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 bats. There. Okay. That was kind of dangerous. Okay, I'm gonna go out of the way that they broke. And oh my gosh, skeleton wards. This is actually the perfect time to use my garlic now, because the garlic just destroys the skeleton horns. So fast. Okay, I can now evolve the da the daggers as soon as I get a boss chest. So please die. Yes! Oh, a quintuple chest. There we are. That's the thousand edge. 1400, wow. And this is the thousand edge right here. Just infinitely firing daggers. They're really good for clearing a path through things. And they can just shred bosses. Like this one, for example. The Thousand Edge is a really good evolution to go for first. Pretty much, irregardless of the map. <laughs> So there's still so much of the base game left here, and there is also DLC pick too. I just shred anything in my way. That's the one of the best parts. Of a thousand edge. It's just nothing can stand in front of you. You always have a clear path forwards. And grab the cross. I was waiting for all that to happen. Okay, I'm gonna go there and then down. Try to get as much as I can out of these ghost hordes as I can before I can't. Crushed by something. Okay, magic wand. Leveled up. I need uh, the uh, empty tome. I don't have it yet. So, okay, so the, I need to find the empty tome. As quickly as possible. Finish is always good. Empty tome. Okay. Next boss, I can evolve the magic wand then. I want. Very slowly moving. I am moving. Okay. Trying to like get to all the red crystals I can. Okay, good. I'll hide there. Oh. Here we go. Magic wand upgrade. Upgrades the Holy Wand, I do not know what it does. Fires no delay. Oh, it's the exact same as the Thousand Edge. Just it auto-fires in whatever direction it feels like. Crowd first. Garlic. Uh, one more level, I think, and then I can evolve the garlic 
into the Soul Eater. Just gotta carve a path. Oh, there's a lot of things going on right now. Do I? I don't know if I have. Do I have the last level for the garlic? No, I don't. Damn it! What do I need for the cross? They're already forgotten. Um, cross, 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 cross. Why can't I see it in this list? There it is. I need the clover. I have the clover. Okay. I need to level up the garlic. Or the cross right now. Okay. I need to level up the garlic, the cross, or the fire one now. And then I can immediately evolve them. Cross. Okay. Heaven Sword. Okay. Oh, yeah. Awesome. I think I have. Wait. Oh no, this might be too early. Damn it! It's too early. Is I think this is actually the last level of the Fire Wand. Yeah, oops. <laughs> okay, I need to kill a boss now. Again. Now I can upgrade the fire wand to the hellfire. Red crystal! Okay, got Imari. Garlic. Okay, can upgrade the garlic now. Imari. Okay, Sling's gonna upgrade now. Okay. Hellfire. From the Fire Wand. Okay, I'm starting to get, like, a nice little mix of creature- of, like, abilities that kind of mesh together. The garlic keeps things away from stuff that's, like, things that are close to me it keeps away. The Thousand Edge cleaves the path for me. The, uh, Hellfire and the Swords, the, he the Heaven Sword, both, um, just, like, mass clear enemies to, like, keep the numbers down. And hopefully the Gadiamari will help with the keeping the numbers down soon, as soon as I evolve it. I need to level it up a bunch first, because I've been kind of neglecting it. Oh, I took a bunch of damage there. It's really rough when the Bat Horde pushes things into you. Otherwise, the Bat Hordes are great for XP. Eddie Amari. Okay. Out of my way. Through. Ah! Stop pushing flowers into me. Flowers hurt. They're prickly. Got the Amari. Got the Amari. Got the Amari. Okay. General damage. Now I can evolve the Gadi Amari. Uh, what do I have left? Okay, so I can evolve the Gadiamari, I can, and I can evolve the garlic. Both now. I just need a chest. I need two chests. Okay, I see the boss right here, and then there's two to the left. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, Gadiamari has been evolved into Vicious Hunger. So that'll keep, help keep the enemy account down a lot. And I can focus fire bosses with a knife. Okay. Evolve the garlic now. To the soul eater. And now my... Entefecta? No, it's five. My hex effecta is complete. Because this will... This will life steal for me. Like if you watch my health, it's going up right now. So this will help get me some more life, keep me healthy, and it will also destroy any projectiles that come at me. There was another boss somewhere. Oh, I see, I see a bat down here, super bat. But that's not what I was looking for. There was a purple boss earlier. Slowly trying to, to like favorite all the songs that I like on SoundCloud so that I can have like a selection to play during the streams. Rather than just like randomly sifting for whatever stuff is available from one particular provider. I've been using Outer Tone. It's a it's just a company that has a SoundCloud account that has a lot of like royalty free. Oh yeah, I should definitely shout them out, because, like, I really appreciate the fact that they have a shit ton of royalty-free music, so I wouldn't be able to, like, afford to buy anything. That's really appreciative. Yeah, that's really appreciated. Oh, there's the purple boss. This is the boss here of the stage. Thousand Edge to make short work of it. At some point, I want to try. Um, oh, god damn it! I want to try Clock Lancet, Laurel, Thousand Edge. Um, what would be the other one? And then three other ones. I'm not sure which other ones. And I want to try to take down the Reaper. Because the Thousand Edge will deal the damage. The... Oh. Thousand Edge will deal the damage. The Laurel, whenever it gets unfrozen from the Clockland set, will protect me from its attacks at one-shots. And, well, the Clockland set will keep it frozen. But I need three other things to like kind of support that. Ideally, things that can focus fire. Maybe the magic wand as well. I really need to find like. I really need to find some light sources that I can break. Because if I can get a... Oh, which power-up is it? Um, if I can get the Attract Orb one that, like, lets you pick up a ton of shit, that would be amazing. Oh! There's an Attract Orb already on the ground. It's over here somewhere. Okay, a little bit more to the right. North and right. Okay, should be right around here somewhere. Okay, 
that freezes time, it should be right up here. Apparently I'm on top of it. There it is. That actually didn't give me as much as I expected. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is actually getting really dicey. This is actually getting really dicey. <laughs> oh! Oh, flamethrower! What happened to the flamethrower? I don't know what happened to the flamethrower. Sad. Could have used that a lot. Okay, clearing a path for the super bats. Ten seconds. Five seconds. One. And Reaper. Oh. Cool. I completed the stage. I'm not going to bother reviving because the Reaper... Um, the, I, unless I can freeze the Reaper, there's no point. I, I can't kill him. Hold six different weapon evolutions at once. Unlock Torona's box. I would love to see what's in Torona's box. Is that a weapon? Oh, yes, it is. No, it's a perk. It works with a weapon that I don't have. Well, I'll buy this, I guess, and then deactivate it. Oh, you can't deactivate it until you buy it completely. Okay, well, whatever. I'm not going to bother with that. Oh, do I even want to play more? My voice is kind of starting to get sore. I'll do a quick one. I'll do a quick one with, like, some stuff that I actually am more familiar with, because... Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go with Gennaro because he's... Actually, I just did a bunch of Thousand Edge stuff. Who do I want to pick? Oh, I want to do Dominero. I've been meaning to, to uh, try him out. And I'm just going to try the fourth stage for the first time because I don't know what it does. There. Oh no, I already tried this stage before. Eh. Ah. At least the King Bible's good. Should... King Bible's pretty good to start out with. He has increased area, which means the Santa water's gonna be really good. I gotta say, I really wonder how they name these things, because, like, Ichone, Santa water, um, Panda Labrador, King Bible, Gaudiamari, like, all of them are kind of strange. Maybe they make more sense in a different language? I think Gadiamari sounds like a different language to me. I assume that's... I assume that means something in a different language. Bible? Just fucking around in this one area. Now the spinach... Who is the spinach? Pitches for the fire wand. I don't know if area is gonna help much with that. I don't think area is gonna help with much with a lot of these. I can be fairly close to things, so I'll pick Laurel. I might actually want to pick Axe, even though it probably won't synergize with this character, just because the thing that upgrades it is the Candle Labrador, which augments area, and area synergizes with this character. Clover was for cross. I'm not doing cross. Not again. Not enough cross. Plus, it's also not incredibly good in my opinion. Okay. Get Candle Labrador. Axe, eventually. Lots of XP. 
I know this stage gets more dangerous the farther I go into it. So I'm just starting, just like hanging around the start here because it's the safest way for me to gather XP at the start of the round. Area help whip. Maybe. I'm going to keep loving the King Bible though. Because eventually the King Bible will be able to evolve and that would be kind of awesome. Oh, if I can get an early evolution of the King Bible, I'll be able to get XP so quickly. Snack. Bone snack. Uh, no. 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 Thank you. Okay, maybe it doesn't get more dangerous the farther you go in, it just gets more dangerous. Full stop. Uh, what is this? Oh, those explode. Uh, I don't like that. Oh, Song of Mana is perfect for this, actually. I love Son Song of Mana. It's one of the newest ones I got. It's really good for clearing things, and it benefits a lot from area. Completely forgot about it. Oh! I should obviously- okay, I definitely need to go Garlic. Because area. You need to find Garlic. But the Pumarola is what you evolve garlic with, so... Yeah. XP. Okay, magic wand, cross... Dogman's area. And I certainly need more area, as much as I can get. up here. Close am I to actually evolving something? I don't know if I need to hold on to the axe or not. Or axe. I don't know if I want to hold on to the chest or not. When you're reading and talking at the same time. Okay. No, I'm not close enough to evolving things. I'll just shake the chest. Okay, more area. That'll help my Song of Mana a lot. I need this Skull of Maniac for the Skull of, for the skull of Mana. The Song of Mana. Ah! These things just, like, spawn underneath you. Really frustrating. Makes it really hard to avoid them, too. Ah! I'm trying to pick up the mana and they're in the way! So rude! Okay, no kniff today. Uh, I think that's a mini boss. Oh! These. the, um. the candelabras like this are. They're just like the gardens, like in the first level. Oh, that wasn't a boss, that was just a normal enemy. When the, the little like floating skulls cross over like on top of the uh, skeleton enemies, it looks like they just have like a really big head. Oh, Torona's box. First item but increases might, projectile speed, duration, and area. What do you mean by cursed item? Oh, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> I'm going to reroll for King Bible. Damn it. Oh well. No. 
Okay, thankfully, like, the snacks aren't actually that dangerous. Okay, King Bible's maxed. I can start making the holy... 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 Unholy Vespers, that's what it is. The, I can start making the holy shit. Wait, what? Oh, I don't have the Spellbinder yet! Oh shit, I was trying to fuse it when I don't have anything to fuse it with. Shoot. Okay, garlic. Okay, the garlic's gonna help. I have a shit ton of area stuff. Stop appearing under me! That is a lot of explody things. I'm gonna go near them to clear them out. Okay, Skelomaniac. I think I need this. Yeah, this upgrades the the, the Song of Mana to Mananaja. Sure. I I can speak. Ooh. Free chicken. I love floor chicken with that authentic floor taste. There we go. I can evolve the King Bible now. Okay, the Unholy Vespers will be really nice. They'll help a lot. I can actually start to, like, head north now that I have some sort of, like, protection against things. Because, like, there's stuff... There's, like, a green arrow pointing north, so there's, like, a permanent unlock somewhere I don't have. Oh, man! Okay, time to level up, like, 50 times. That actually wasn't that much, surprisingly. Pearl? This is even better than the knife is for... for just, like, walking in a straight line if you want to go specifically up or down. If you go away, I want some of these crystals that I keep around. I guess it's kind of just inevitable because I destroy things above and below me. So I'm going to leave things behind no matter what I do. Garlic. That'll help me. Ooh, flamethrower. Boss! 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 Aw, I hoped I'd be able to kill him with a flamethrower. Give me my unholy vespers. Drop a box, you little shit. Shit! You did not drop a box! Well, he was shit. So much XP on the ground, I cannot pick it all up. Just, it's just impossible to collect it all in time. Because by the time I, I pick it all up, there's more. Okay, yeah, I was gonna go axe. And center water. I'll pick up some of this stuff while I'm here. Hold on, I don't think I need any of these. Crowns for pentagram, tier geese is for something I don't have, I think. 
Oops. I accidentally clicked there. I don't actually know what I selected. I don't think I've evolved the Song of Mana before. But I'm kind of excited to see what that evolves into. I'm like intentionally trying not to look at what it evolves into. Oh, if I want to farm XP, this is effective. I can farm things on the other side of the wall, too. There's two red crystals down there already. Wow. Three. I guess this is the way to farm. I hope that they doesn't, like... I hope that it doesn't, like, delete XP after a while when there's, like, too many things on the ground. That'd be kind of sad. Enter water. Enter water. And a Labrador. And a Labrador. Song of Mana. Song of Mana. So much XP! And now I can get this up to the top! Oh! Ooh! I can evolve something! What am I gonna evolve? Oh my gosh, this is the new thing! Oh, this is exciting! What is it? It's the... There's a particular word I want to you to, like, misname it as, and I can't say it on stream, because Twitch does not allow me to reference such things, even though they are legal in the country that I am in. Because they are not illegal in other countries, even though you can smoke it very safely here. But any discussion of it has to have, like, a specific tag. So I'm not going to discuss whatever the thing is. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Okay, this is like the best area weapon I've ever seen. Oh. This is like the pentagram, but better. I guess that's fair, because the, like, the thing it makes you use to upgrade it... ...like, increases the number of enemies on the screen. So I guess it makes sense that, like, it would give you, like, a stupid good AoE weapon. Ooh, spinny dragons. And harpies. I didn't mean to go quiet, I just like, I'm just so zen right now. I love, I love this weapon so much! What is it called again? Manager. It's just so cool looking. Let's kill this boss. As soon as I kill this boss, I... lose the drop. Fuck. Damn it. Okay. Okay, I'm about to be able to level something to evolve something. I would really like to be able to do that soon. What is it that's about to evolve? The Santa Water is about to evolve. And the King Bible is about to evolve. Oh, I'm excited.
Okay, I'm going to keep working on the garlic, because that will level up soon. But that'll be able to evolve soon as well. Yeah, flamethrower! What on earth was that? Oh! Walter GK followed! Thank you so much! It's always nice to see new faces here. Hope you're doing okay. Welcome to the stream! We're just playing some vampire survivors right now. And picking up copious amounts of mana. Ooh, there's a boss! Yes! Yes! Give me my super garlic! Time to garlic! That's not garlic. Lots of, that's the Unholy Vestiments, which is the King Bibles upgrade, which is very good. Wait for it. Wait for it. And... Unholy Vestiment... Vestiment... <laughs> unholy something something something. It's the Unholy Red Saw Blade. Saw blade attack. Okay, this is actually like getting this is like such a ridiculous combination. The unholy vestments, vest, ve, vest, vest, unholy vespers. That's what it's called. I was, I was just calling it the thing that is clothing. Uh, okay. I guess Pamela again. Really like the chance to level some stuff up, but I need a boss. For that boss, 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 boss. Drop the treasure chest, please. Yep. Evolution time. Cool. That is Labora, uh, the Santa Waters upgrade. All Santa Water damaging zones follow you and grow when they move. Wait a second, and... Oh. And... Is, yeah, this little wet zones on the ground. They move very slowly, but, like, as they overlap, they deal, like, each deal their own damage. They're really good. I have, like, amazing AoE right now. Oh, this game is so satisfying. Like, ugh. I can't believe this is a $6 game. Like, that's like such an insanely low price for something that is going to have so much replayability for me. I think I've already put like 20 hours into this game, and I o I've only had it for like a week. Oh. Oh god. I don't know what that was. But I did not like it. What? What is going on? Oh no. Okay, those are shooting stars. They're like falling from the sky. Ah, I don't want to be wherever the exclamation marks are up here. Axe. Okay. Grab all that XP. If I ever get the Attracty Orb thing, I am going to be doing so well. Like, like, the, the power-up, not the, uh, perk. Which I just got. Garlic? Gosh, this is so... This is such a powerful combination. I'll pick Axe. The, uh... Unholy Vespers, the Garlic, and the... Oh my god, it's so hard to pronounce it. Man Manager. Mangina! Yes, the Mangina. Let's just call it that, <laughs> because I can say that and I can't pronounce it like the other one with the U. Oh, 
No, I don't. <laughs> I don't want upgrades to the things that makes the, make the enemies harder. No, stop upgrading that thing. Increase enemy speed, health, quantity, and frequency. Actually, you know what? I'm doing well enough that it might actually be worth it to increase the uh, enemy quantity. I'm doing really well. Okay. I can now... Okay, the garlic and the axe are now ready to evolve. Uh, I have a free perk slot now, too. I can put something in there, because I, I don't have whatever the laurel needs to evolve. So I guess I'll just do spinach, because it's generic damage. And I'm going to finish leveling up the Skull of Maniac. Why am I leveling up so much? What is going on? I must have stepped on, like, a super attract orb or something. Level 73. Yay, it's my cinnamon bun! Cinnamon bun. Eat souls. Evolved garlic. Hmm. I'm- oh, I'm about to get the Bracer. The Bracer's just north of here. Well, I'll get an extra Bracer perk. And I don't want the always upgrade thing, because I want to be able to upgrade the Bracer. I'll we'll get the always upgrade soon, though. Yeah, it's a garlic cinnamon bun! You know, like, every, like everyone puts garlic on their cinnamon buns, right? Makes sense. That sounds absolutely horrific. You know, that thing that no one ever does. I don't even need the flamethrower, because- oh god. Wait, things are actually getting close to me. I'm more powerful if I don't move, because of the, uh, Labora. That is converging on my location. Oh, I don't really need to wait. I want to move towards the green arrow for whatever that deck of cards is. Unless there's a question mark up there, and I wonder if that's a new character. Because I certainly will not say no to a new character. Just wading through all the enemies. Mini dragon things are cool. I want one as a pet. Oh. Oh, it's when you step on these, like, circle thingies, it spawns the, uh, all the weird light sources. Ooh. There's a... There's a beefy boy. There's a strong creature over here. Come here, strong woman. There we go, Death Spiral. That's the upgrade for the axe. I think that is the last evolution that we're going to be getting. Yep, that is the last evolution we're getting. I love the Death Spiral, it's really good. I am now even stronger. Because I wasn't strong enough before. I love that it just punts the dragons away. It actually punts some of them off screen if you watch closely. Like I think those are I like I wonder if they're like despawning because they're getting punted off screen or not. I think some of these light sources actually like will drop power ups. Oh. Oh my gosh. It's infinitely spawning the red things. Like, at super fast speeds. And they're just getting destroyed. Is that giving me 
Was that dropping XP every time? Oh my gosh, it's dropping XP every time. That's ridiculous. Okay, no. I can't get distracted. I need to go north. Uh... I don't think... I'm gonna keep going, because I think that... I don't know if that's an upgrade, like a perk or not. If it's a perk, I want to be able to upgrade it. Oh god. So much XP. Sure. I will take all of these light sources. I will see these light sources, and I will eat your chicken. How close am I? Okay, I'm almost there. Give me my deck of cards. Oh, there's a boss there. Hello. I don't really care. Well, okay, I'll get the gold. Fine. Oh, boy. Cool, 400 gold. Okay, so that was a silver tier chest, a triple. I'm basically untouchable now. <laughs> oh, there it is! Why am I moving so slow? What's going on? Urgh, get back here! What? Why are you going away from me? No! No! Okay. Enables the unlocking and activation of Arcanas. What the fuck is that? Ar what is this? That boss melted in two seconds. What boss? I didn't see a boss. <laughs> Healing is doubled, recovering HP nearby enemies. Recover... A recovering HP damages nearby enemies for the same amount. Okay. Cool. Oh, this is super bad. There was a super bad. Oh! What is this? Uh, I don't know why that chest was purple. Uh, okay, I'm not going to be picking up any more any more perks, so I'm just going to... Next time I level up, I'm just going to do the auto chicken. Auto chicken, chicken, chicken. I just love watching it pump them off screen. That's really funny. Uh, no. No. I don't know what's gonna happen when those hit me, but I don't want to find out. No. 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 It's like fucking shooting stars everywhere. Ah! No! I don't know how much damage they're gonna do, and I don't want to find out. Oh, I walked past it! Oh no! Okay, I really like this dude. This character's fun. Is it off the side here? Wait, where am I? Okay, no, I need to go a little bit farther. That's not it. I'm almost at it. Oh, the Chimera thing. Oh, I need to move a bit slower now. These things actually, like, take damage. Or, these things actually, like, take some damage to get to! Ah! Thing above me, thing above me, thing above me, thing above me! Also, where is this question mark thing? No. No. No! 
Leave me alone. Bad Chimera thing. It says it's right of me. How can it be right of me? I can't walk right. I don't understand. Is it something down here? Yeah, the question marks to the to the northeast of me. What? Okay, that's a fireplace. Second, I was wondering if that was a, like a door or something. Not. Okay. I don't just like smush my face against the wall. If like there's like a hidden door or something or what. What is going on? Why can't I find this thing? What does this do? Oh. I don't need more light sources. I'm so confused why I can't get to whatever the hell this thing is. Enemies are getting progressively harder, and I'm more or less just ignoring them. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, crab? 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 Crab! Wait, what? Understand what's going on. But also crab? Everything becomes crab. Uh. Uh. I don't really like this. Uh. I think that I'd really wish the Labora would stop watering him. Because he's like. Very big. He does not need more watering. Whoa, what the fuck's that? Why is there... What is going on? Okay, and this is just more... I was hoping this would, like... I really don't know what's going on. I really... I just do not know what's going on. Oh, wait. I have a flamethrower. That. That's a thing. I'm sad that I can't get that. These enemies are getting tankier. Oh no, I might experience a mild challenge at some point. things that are stuck on the other side of the wall because they've been punted away, I think. That's funny. Oh boy, I leveled up. I'm really sad that I can't figure out how to get to the question mark thing. I, I, want, I want the thing. I want the loot. I guess I'll have to look it up at some point. Chimera, 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 large chimera, large chimera. It is large and in charge. Is that the giant scorpion tail? Are you happy to see me? You're way too happy to see me. Fine. Okay. Well, whatever. I'm going south. I'm going south, hoping to get to the cross. So I can, like, blow everything up. Because, you know, why not? It's a long way to go through all these enemies. I lost two more minutes. Uh, nope. Nope. 
No. Bad Chimera. Bad. Bad. Dit. Damn it. Dit, damn it. Like, just do anything but what you're doing to me. The lamps are trying to chase me down. The world's very hostile, even the lamps hate you. I guess technically they're kind of lob Not lamps, but you know. Like, I don't really care. Where is the cross? The cross is coming up in a second. There it is. I wonder, what happens if I wait till the Reaper boss comes on screen and then I cross him? I don't know if he's, like, gonna destroy the cross or not. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. There's a lot of, a lot of things here. Uh, there's a lot of bosses. Like, a lot of bosses. That's, like, a whole shit ton of bosses. Oh. No. No, don't like. Don't like. No. No. <laughs> 20 seconds. Oh fuck, I accidentally got the cross. No. 10 seconds. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Finish. Oh, I've never beat the fourth stage before. That's awesome. Defeat a total of 3,000 dre- Oh, I have a lot going on. Find the Menzo. Unlocked Arcana. Unlocked six. Okay, unlocked number two, Twilight Rec- Okay, unlocked Capel Magna. Unlocked Banish. I already have Banish. A false song of mana. Okay, I know I did that. Unlocked hyper mode for four normal stages. Unlocked O Soul. Wow. What the heck is O Soul? Yes, I get to be a dog! I can be a dog! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I can play as a dog! Oh, that makes me happy! Oh, Banish. Upgrade Banish. I'll upgrade that too. I want to play as O Soul. The only problem is that I need to rest my voice now. I, I can feel it getting kind of rough now, and I need I need to rest it. I will leave you with this tidbit of information though. Once we finally do all the achievements, and lock all the characters, and go through all of them, and complete all the levels, and all of that stuff, there's a DLC with, like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 new weapons. And probably a bunch of new characters as well. Actually, yeah, I think it has four new characters. Oh, okay. I'm very excited for that. But uh, it is time to end today's stream. Thank you all for coming to this one weird and random stream. We actually had, like, as many people as we usually do for seven days to die today. I was surprised. Awesome. Have a great day, everyone. Thank you for everyone who is here and has been here. I really appreciate you all. It's so great to see lots of people. It makes it so much more fun for me. And I hope you all have a great day. Bye.